Hello fellow exiles, I'm Rotten John and we are back in Conan Exiles. Today I wanted to talk a little bit about the mod mismatch screen, why you're getting it, and how to get rid of it. Also I'll link a video at the end of this to show you how to disable those pesky Conan Exiles startup movies every time you load your game up. So here we are loading up our game just like we normally would. Find our favorite server such as Exiled Lands by Rotten John here. So the game loads in just as it normally would and well then you get this mod mismatch screen. So the problem is is the mods that are running on the server do not match the mods that you have in your local modlist.txt file. So what's happening is your mod list is actually downloading a temporary mod list that will allow you to play on your selected server. And this can take a little bit of time depending on the amount of mods that are installed on the server. Now once your modlist.txt file has been updated with a temporary mod list the game will continue loading back in as normal. Now you can verify this by exiting back to the main menu, clicking on your mods tab, and you'll see here that it's telling you the game is currently using a temporary mod list. You need to restart the game to manage your mods. Do you want to restart now? So sure, let's restart the game and get into how to fix this and prevent the mod list mismatch screen from coming up again. So once the game is restarted, we're going to click on mods and this is going to bring up a mods list page. And here you can see that we have fashionist in our selected mods list. However, we do not have Hosav's UI in the selected mods list. The point being, we need whatever mods that the current server we're playing on is using to be installed in our selected mods list, and they have to be installed in the correct order also, most of the time. And by looking at the server selection screen, we can see that this server is running Fashionist and Hosavs in that order, and that's what we're going to need to set up here in our selected mods screen. Now if you don't see the mod you're looking for, then you'll need to go to the Steam Workshop page and subscribe to that mod so that it will show up in your Available Mods section here. And here you can see we found our Hosov's UI mod. So we can highlight it and then click the right facing arrow to move it in on our Selected Mods section. Also, while you have your mod selected, you can use the up and down arrows to move that mod wherever it needs to be to match the order that they are on on the server you're using. Now our selected mods match the mods that the server are running and in the correct order. Now we can restart the game and the game will load in normally and we will not have to see the mod mismatch screen anymore. Now another way to do this is to go to whatever drive that you have Conan Exiles installed on and change directories from Steam Library to Steam Apps, Common, Conan Exiles, Conan Sandbox, and find your mods folder. Once you open your mods folder, you'll find the modslist.txt file in there, and you can manually list all of the mods that you need for whatever server you're playing on. The method I've just shown you on how to clear up the mods mismatch page is by far the safest if you're not comfortable in moving around through your files folders and making changes to them yourself. So I hope some of you have found this video helpful. 
And if you have, please remember to hit that subscribe button. It's free for you, and it helps me know what content you guys like the most. And don't forget, I'm going to show a card that links you to another video on how to get rid of those pesky startup movie screens every time you start Conan Exiles game.